Kai te tawaiata, koro koro tui a rako Eva Lankin tēnā. Ko ia ke ia ia ko ngā pūkenga katoa e hāngai ana ki te awaiata. A rako te waiata, kuta, pahu, ka kōrero tātou ki ia ia ki a rongo ai ngā kōrero muna e pā ana ki ana waiata tau matara. Kia ora Eva. Kia ora. How are you doing? <laughs> Good. Uh, congratulations on your new album, Black Eagle. How do you feel about that? I feel good. Uh, it's, a, it's a long process. It's all done now. I can hopefully move on to the next new things. Yep. Speaking of process, what, what, what's your songwriting process? Sometimes I start off with the title of what the song is going to be. Then I evolve into chords on the guitar. And then <laughs> and it goes from there. But sometimes it, it just varies whatever what mood I'm in. So, now I know you play drums, mm -hmm. guitar as well. Yeah. Do you make up your own beats for your music? No, I'm not no. a beat maker. No. Not at all. I wouldn't even go there. But <laughs> um, no, I just like I like trying different things, especially if you if you know people say you can sing. I mean, let's let's give some other stuff a try. But I mean, they were the first. I love music. It all takes practice, so that's what I did. So I just kept doing it because I love I love music and anything to do with music. Just let's give it a try. But yes, I might try the whole beat making thing someday. What came first? Was it the drums, guitar, or singing? First, it was um, it was drumming. Then I played. Oh, actually, sorry, it was guitar. Um, that was because um, there were these guys that. Uh, <laughs> They used to live, I used to live at these apartments and um, there were these guys that, that you know, pretty boys and popular back in those, you know, special days. Um, and so I tried to impress them. Oh, <laughs> so yeah. I, started, I picked up a guitar and I started learning all these songs that were popular then in the 90s. And then, um, and then it just, just became an instrument part of me. And I was like, oh, I love music. And then that's when I started evolving into drumming. And then I started songwriting and then I kind of stuck to just writing songs with my guitar. So how do I fix my mistakes? How do I fix what I broke? If the world could say these things, I would fly back home like you today. Like you today. Tell us, where do you draw your inspiration from? Everything. That's why I like to, to travel, because I'm such an adventurous person, and I just want to try things, because you just never know what's out there. And so that what inspires me is just things that are unexpected. I mean, I, I grew up in an island family, um, and, you know, they're, they're quite kind of just sticking to their own thing they like, and everyone follows. But I was always the outcast. I wanted to try things that uh, my family had never tried before, my cousins or, you know, and the friends I hung out um, school days and stuff. Where do you see your style of music in five years' time? I would think that um, I, I go with the time of life. So I, I will definitely move on from because my first release was the, the EP in 2008. The new stuff that will be coming out this year is very different from what I did back in 2008. So I've actually, I've actually improved and I've grown from, from, you know, from who I was as a, as a musician back then. So I think in five years' time, it'll be different from what, you know, so I just, I, I'm kind of that person that just keeps moving forward. Any last words of advice? In life in general, just just make the most of life because you never know what's going to happen and, and enjoy it. But um, at the end of the day, it's it's people that matter because they make, make life happen. And, you know, I mean, things can be a fall, things can be a rise. But, uh, you know, it's, it's part of life and you just never take anything serious. And I think that's the reason why these problems come to life. And so I'm trying to avoid all that stuff and, and want to be able to, you know, just move on and keep the passion <laughs> alive. That's what, that's what I say with all, yeah. <laughs> with everyone. <laughs> keep the passion alive. Take it away.